Uh, we have our last contestant in round one. All right, we're probably running behind, so yeah. I'm going to bring him up. He's an incredible comedian. He's a star of Hulu's This Fool. Give it up for Chris Estrada. Chris Estrada. How's it going, guys? What's hey, up, Chris? Chris? I'm back. <laughs> After be being beaten by Bruce motherfucking Gray <laughs> last time. I'm tired of Bruce Gray coming up here with his charming, like, oaky Bakersfield charm. And that stupid kick he does all the time. <laughs> it's cheating, Bruce, and you fucking know it. <laughs> all right. I love Bruce. All right. I'm uh, just going to my jokes now? Whatever, oh, yeah. I, to I totally we forgot how this is it goes. Talk. All right, TikTok. Uh, see, uh, also, you know, you're going to hear some stuff that maybe has been said before because I went up last. I feel like it was rigged against me. <laughs> you know, I just, uh, I think uh, in terms of TikTok, I'm not on it. I, w I made an account once and then I looked for porn and saw there was no porn on it <laughs> and then thought there's no point for me to be on this fucking website. I'm taking my dirty ass back to Twitter and X hamster. <laughs> and uh, I, think, I think the reason TikTok is getting banned is because it's gay as hell. I think it is gay as hell. And, and I mean that in a good way, you know? It's, I think it's like, the thing about TikTok, it's, it's full of, uh, of like non-binary 13 year olds exposing America for what its truth is, you know? Right. And I don't think, I, I think people don't like that. I think people, like, it's all about who gives you the message, you know? Like, a few a few weeks ago, there was this, there was a bunch of kids on there, 13 year olds with like purple hair and shit. You didn't know if they were a boy or a girl. I'm not judging, you just didn't know. And <laughs> you just straight didn't know. They're truly non-binary people and they, they brought up the Obama letters. Uh, I mean, not the Obama letters, the Osama Bin Laden letters. <laughs> he was in on it too, by the way. He, was, he wasn't even president yet, but he was in on it, you know. And they brought up those letters and they brought up how, you know, Osama Bin Laden was like, I'm attacking the country because of this, because you guys did this to Afghanistan back in the 80s. And these kids, all these fucking gay kids explained it. Again, I'm not calling them gay as an offense. They're truly, they're gay kids. And God bless them, I love them, you know? Not like that, but I love the who th that they love themselves. And, and uh, people were mad. People, were, people weren't mad at what they were saying. People were mad. It was like old people being like, I can't believe some fucking queer ass kid with like blue hair is telling me this, you know? If you had some Travis Kelsey motherfucker on there, or some charming Oki who can do a stupid kick with his <laughs> thing, explaining what the government has done on TikTok. I think people would take it a lot better. I think it wouldn't be a problem, you know? That's it, that's all I got. Chris Estrada. Chris! That was fantastic. So you're you're not on TikTok, but you're you're pro TikTok, or you're not. You don't want it to be banned. I, I don't want it to be banned. Yeah, because you love know. gay kids. I love gay kids. Yeah. I okay. love. I, I think I summed it up. Yeah, that's <laughs> I, really, yeah. I truly love gay kids. Yeah, yeah. Yes, <laughs> that sounds weird to say. <laughs> I hope nobody's recording this. <laughs> these are wow. these are what every presidential debate will be pretty soon. Yeah. They're like, yeah. You got these gay kids, which is fine. Which is fine. Hey. Hey. I mean, they hey. got blue hair. I don't care. <laughs> That's what it's called. I can say what it's called. Yeah. <laughs> that is funny. I'm gonna I'm gonna learn that fucking thing he does. Yeah, that's really. Good. I'm gonna. I'm and also, I'm teaching a workshop. On this it. is this Please is the, course wall. This yeah, is the back. toughest part. Like yeah. like like Bruce <laughs> last time he had pickleball in round one. Oh yeah. And he said everything there was to say about pickleball. I got and that. people were like, I didn't know we were doing fucking dissertations yeah. on fucking pickleball. <laughs> so uh, round round one last spot. Not a lot of meat on the bone left, and you still okay. Well, don't go that angle. fucking far. <laughs> He's just like, not a lot of meat on the bone. This you guy know. tried. You found an angle. I mean, yeah. he's going through a tough time. <laughs> yeah, His TV show got canceled. <laughs> he's, you We're know. bringing it back. He, he, Say, hashtag it back. hashtag yeah. save this fool. Save no, this no, no, fool. No, he is just like. You know, save this fool so he can write better jokes than what he's trying to say. <laughs> yeah. Whatever gets it saved. No. <laughs> no, that was, I, I agree that uh, we do need someone. You're right, Chris. We do need someone besides gay kids talking to it, us. Yeah, uh, your point so. was made. Not it won them over. Because other people need that. I love gay kids talking to us. We get you it. Know? You love I, gay kids. You're love in love gay with kids. gay kids, yeah. man. Yeah, That's super. I, I love them. 
I, I, I hang out by their schools. <laughs> <laughs> They're seg- they have segregated schools now? Yeah. Yeah. They have their own schools, yeah. yeah. I wish they did. Yeah. <laughs> Chris Estrada, everyone. Oh, keep it going for Chris Thanks Estrada. Thanks, Chris. That's it. That's round one in the books.